Hey guys, I am so stoked right now. I am on my way to Complete Trailers of California. They are located in Oceanside to pick up my Futura Super Sport racing trailer. So after the incident at Chuckwalla and the nightmare that was trying to get back home because I couldn't drive the car back, I decided I just need to finally get myself a trailer. I've rented U-Haul trailers over the years, but I'll be honest, U-Haul trailers are a pain in the ass when you've got a low profile track car. Here we are, complete trailers of California. Shout out to these guys. Check that out, I'm so excited. So, lowering trailer. Basically, just drive it right up or winch it up. I got all the bells and whistles here. Locking tire rack. You get a spare set of wheels and tires up there. Rock guard. It's got electronic winch. It's even got a solar panel to charge everything up. How cool is this? So that way, perfect. Yeah, like I said, some guys will just leave this mounted that way, and you can. Um, but if you pick up another car and say the tow hook's on this side or this side, yeah. all you gotta do is just move this. That's great. Oh, I see. Oh, yeah, yeah. Because yeah. you can mount it directly right up front, and technically, it's actually a little bit closer because you don't have to mount it on the side. You can mount it right here. So, car gets pulled up, just like that. So essentially, you just unlock it here, yeah. reduce the tension on the strap, and then you can, when, the, when you pull this out, this bar, you just set your wheels up here, and then yep. the bar goes through the center of the wheels. Yeah. So. So as you see the functionality of the trailer, you can tell why it's such a badass piece of equipment. I mean, you just basically drive your car onto it, raise it up. If you need to winch it, because your vehicle's inoperable or something, it's really simple uh, to move the winch around. The winch stores inside of a compartment on the tongue. And, you know, the battery is, you know, recharged through solar power. So you don't have to worry about your battery being dead when you go to winch it or raise or lower the trailer. Um, got that lockable tire rack up top for a spare set or two of wheels. You know, there's been times where I've had tires that have only been able to last like two sessions and I want to try and get like four sessions out of them and then it's kind of ruined my day because the tires are just worn out a little quicker than I'd like um, unexpectedly. So it's nice to have a backup and then on top of that, and the trailer's got a spare tire as well. I didn't show that, but it's hidden underneath the trailer. So usually, you know, spares are, you know, out in sight and they look ugly and everything. This is just, the spare is hidden right underneath it. The trailer even comes with a torque wrench and sockets to tighten the lugs down. So I'm very impressed. Two thumbs up to Futura trailers. They're out of New Zealand. Check out their products. They're really awesome. And thumbs up to uh, complete trailers of California um, super helpful guys they helped me order this thing and get all the bells and whistles on it got everything installed on time for me very easy to do business with so huge shout out to complete trailers thanks a lot for watching guys be sure to uh, follow along in the channel so you can see how 
the rebuild on the E92 M3 goes and how we uh, finish out the season. Next race will be Laguna Seca and I hope to make it putting the M3 on this trailer here. Be sure to like and subscribe and we'll see you on down the road.